put a little spacing in our drawing. We talked about what you can and cannot in between to and from. I can in between because these are part of the same group. I cannot in between between one group and another because I don't want the head to, to scale. And I can in between between these two keyframes because they are also from the same group. Now I'm going to put in a bit of easing. And I want to ease out of my first um, frame. So I'm going to choose this button, set ease for multiple parameters. Now, the ease is happening to the right of the keyframe. And the bigger the number, the more ease. And it's between 0 and 100. So I'm going to just pick something at the beginning, maybe 50. 50% 50 of the time, it's easing out. I'm going to apply it. And you can see I have a bit of ease here. Now if I made a bigger number, 80, you can see there's more ease and so on and so forth. But let's just pick, let's pick 60 just for fun. Apply. Now I want to ease in at the end, so I'm going to select this frame, press that button as well, and now we can see that we're easing in, so the animation is happening on the left of the keyframe, so I'm going to make it a bit more of an ease at the end, I'll make it 80, apply. That's going to change my animation to be slow, and it's going to speed up, and it's going to slow in. Now, normally what I like to do after that is put everything to on twos, and I'm going to show you in the next video how to automate that. But in this video, again, if you're not happy with what when you when you've watched it, what you're getting, you can always go back in and change the numbers to anything that you think you might want. And I'll just keep mine at 50. Apply. And in our next video, I'll show you how to set the eases onto keyframes on twos.